Can we go in? Oh, Bologna's in. Yeah, okay, let's try and gank her. Drop the ult. Oh my god, dude, I'm shredding. Can I get a third charge? That is a stun. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> this build is absolutely nutty. Like, this is actually good. Like, this is not troll like ADC Zeus in Smite 1. This is, like, genuinely shredding. Oh my god, I'm deleting people. Today, we become legends. Hey, my name's Inter, and welcome back to Smite 2 on Inter Games. Uh, today, we're going to be doing some Zeus mid, but with a twist. We're going to be doing an auto-attack Zeus. I've seen a lot of people raving about this. Apparently, it's actually, like, pretty decent. Uh, also, apparently, tank Zeus is pretty good. Uh, that's not what we're going to be doing this game. We're going to be going for a damage build, but we're going to be going for attack speed. And we're rushing into... Um, where is it? This item, Bragi's Harp, gives us strength, intelligence, attack speed, and then passive, uh, basically, the Talcan's Ring passive from Smite 1. Uh, enemies take bonus damage on my auto attacks. And of course, Zeus has this new 2, where he does uh, AoE damage around him, and then gets an attack speed and movement speed buff. Also, a little bit of haste. Not sure how much haste, they didn't really say, but uh, definitely is noticeable. So yeah, we're going to be going for auto attack Zeus. I don't know where my mid laner is at right now. Um, oh, where their mid laner is at, I should say. But I guess we'll take some tower pressure. It seems like uh, tower pressure is ridiculously important in this game, by the way. Uh, if you haven't played any yet. Um, the tower bounties give, like, such a ridiculous amount of gold. Like, uh, there's been multiple games where we've been down in kills but up in gold because we have tower pressure and we're getting all the bounties. Uh, and vice versa, like, we've been down massively because the enemies have gotten all our towers and stuff. Like, they seem like they're really important. Okay, the uh, Cuckoo is here now. Um, uh, okay, Loki's probably going to get that gold. I think I can just, like, solo the side mid camp at the moment. Maybe one level, uh, level three for that. Get my dirt in it. I think this execute thing on the minions is, like, one of the single best changes made. Like, there's so many changes made in Smite 2, obviously, but that just makes the game feel, like, so much more clean. It allows you to last hit so much easier as well. Like, definitely is a big improvement. And a bigger focus on last hitting is good for, like, skill-based gameplay and stuff, so. Okay, nice. So, we can solo those pretty easily at level 3. I'm a little bit low on mana, but we, uh, we have pots. Should be fine. Yeah, I can see why Tang Zeus might... Oh, oh. Can we kill this guy? Get my strong autos on him? Damn it. No, dude. Oh, I'm so bad. I'm actually so trash. That should have been a kill. Oh, dude. I can't believe I didn't get that guy. That is unbelievable. That was like major skill issue from me, man. But yeah, as I was saying, uh, the, the last hitting thing is like really good in my opinion. Like it just makes uh, laning like so much cleaner. You can just very easily like get the last hits. It gives you a nice indicator on like who you can kill. I get my chain lightning on him. Yeah, having the stun back on Day is also kind of crazy. Like, I, I, I think, honestly, I missed an auto on that Loki because I didn't expect him to get stunned. This is my first time playing Zeus uh, in Smite 2, so I'm not, I'm not used to that thing stunning again. Okay, we have ult. Oh, dude, okay, he's ulting, what? Get some free damage on him. Grab the gold pile as well. Yeah, between these gold piles and, like, the tower bounties, it feels like it's, it's so easy to snowball with gold in this game. Like, snowballing with XP is a little harder, but snowballing with golds, like, feels so easy. Oh, dude, I got my attack speed. Can we ult that? Stun him into it? Oh, dude, Loki's here again? Go away, dude. I should be fine. He doesn't have his ult yet. Okay, as Loki's constantly in mid, we're gonna have to be a little bit more careful going in on that cuckoo. I think maybe I'll just back here. I can get some of my tier twos online. Get some strength and int. Uh, we'll get another axe as well because we need that for the tier two bow. And maybe even another mana pot. I feel like I'm kind of running low on mana a lot. Yeah, this item uh, doesn't give a massive amount of intelligence, but the 30 strength will still be nice because that's just 30 extra damage on all my autos, and we are going for that auto attack build, so having a little bit of strength is actually going to be quite handy for us. Even though uh, none of Zeus's ability scale with strength, but obviously autos scale with 100% strength, so. Yeah, you kind of got it, got it in there a little bit more with the uh, with the two now. 
So I can see why Tank Zeus might be uh, considered. Do we level detonate or do we level the thing? What does this do when it levels? More attack speed, more movement speed, more damage. It's not bad. I feel like detonate's still the way to go, but I might level the two second. Start getting that attack speed online. At the moment, I'm kind of just playing like mostly ability based, to be honest. I feel like as I get my items online, I'm definitely going to want that attack speed a bit more. Oh, hello. Get a stone. Oh my god, dude. Look at my damage. Oh, we hit those. No, no more misplays from me, dude. That, that one misplay in the early game is all you get. Can. I'm going to farm you now. <laughs> With the auto attack zoos, dude. Hell yeah. Oh my god, my attack speed's already so good. Level up the tier 5 as well. Very nice. Okay, Loki's here again. He's on the side camp. I could probably fight him, though, honestly. I'm just not going to use any cooldowns on this wave in case he tries to come and gank me. But if it's just Loki, if it's not like a support rotation, I could probably just handle him. Yeah, there he is. Yeah, dude, we all we stun him into it. Yeah, he's just dead. Dude, having the stun back is so crazy. Okay, we're going to have to probably back out now because Kukul uh, Kuku can's back. But, dude, that, having that stun back is crazy. Being able to like, lock people into your ult and land free basics. Ah, uh, should I stay? I feel like I should stay, dude. This way he's getting shoved in pretty hard. At least stay for those. Maybe I could back now. Ah, actually, no, I'm shoving it fully in. Let's just uh, let's grab these. There we go. Alright, that's my full Bragi's Harp online. I think I might also go, um, yeah, Dagger of Frenzy. My abilities are going to be hitting, like, super, super weak sauce, honestly, with this build. Uh, because I'm going to another strength item here, but, like, it's 60 basic attack damage and, like, 30% attack speed on this item or something. Yeah, 60 basic attack damage and 30% attack speed for 6 seconds with only a 50 second cooldown. Like, this item seems kind of nutty, man. I feel like if you're not building this on your hunters, you're trolling against my too. Like, Dagger of Frenzy seems absolutely crazy. And obviously, uh, I am playing like a hunter right now, building a lot of strength. Oh yeah, nice. Get those yellow numbers, dude. Dude, I've already got so much attack speed as well. Get some free damage on him. Oh, look, he's here, dude. Dude, this guy's constantly here. You can stun him, though. Get the ult down. <laughs> oh my god, dude. I've heard a lot of people say Zeus is strong uh, in the Smite 2 alpha. I I'm kind of feeling that right now, dude. I still deleted that Loki. Like, my abilities aren't even doing that much. I'm just chunking people with these autos right now. Yeah, I think we start leveling the two. Juke that. How much do I need for full dagger frenzy? Oh, a lot. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm pretty heavy poked out because this Loki keeps coming over. But if I just keep killing him, he's surely going to give up at some point, right? Or he's just going to keep feeding me kills. Like, I am missing some farm sometimes because I'm going to back a lot. But I'm kind of fine with that if Loki keeps coming over and giving me free kills. I've got pots as well. I forgot I had pots. Let's use those. Where'd the cuckoo go? Also, is this spawning soon? I oh, don't get an actual timer on that. We'll get it after the wave. Oh, we got super minions in this wave. Oh, Cuckoo's here. I was going to say I could maybe push the tower. But nah, no, not with, not with uh, Cuckoo being here. Oh my god, I've got so much attack speed already with that too. How much does it give? 35% at max rank? Okay, that's kind of nutty, dude. We also get a little bit of haste as well. Okay, Loki's here again on those uh, right side mids, so we'll just play relatively safe. Yeah, I could probably farm full dagger of frenzy, honestly. Also, we once again have no tanks on this team, dude. It seems like people absolutely hate playing tanks in Smite 2. We have an Anubis support and a uh, Kugel can solo. People just really don't want to play tanks. I have to say, the tank item pool does feel a little bit weak sauce compared to the damage to uh, item pool at the moment in the alpha. There are some really good tank items like Meteor Hammer that does uh, like Golden Blade effect but scales on prots. Uh, Glad Shield's still in the game. Uh, the Blackthorn Hammer style item that just gives you a bunch of like uh, defense, health, and power. Uh, or strength. That one's really good too. But it does feel like a lot of the tank items are a little bit lacking, especially the active ones. So I can see why people won't want to play tanks. And just in general, people don't like playing tanks, I guess. So you can maybe go into the jungle here, get a little bit of stuff. 
Doesn't seem like Loki's really keeping on top of his jungle camps. <laughs> oh, that's because he's DC'd. Ah, that's why. Dude, I keep getting DCs constantly in, in this game. I don't know if it's... um. I'm going to vote no just in case he comes back. I get a lot of DCs. I don't know if it's people like just leaving because they know they don't have to worry about getting a ban. Or if it's... um. Office people having like connection issues. I don't know, but I, I, I just tried to play a game earlier and I uh, got a DC as well. Seems to be a lot of people DCing in the alpha. Kind of unfortunate because this game was going great for me. <laughs> Absolutely farming right now. Hopefully he comes back. I, I don't have a lot of faith in it though. Every time there's been a DC, they've never come back. Cuckoo, why are you here? Go, go defend left. There's also a lot of, like, whackness going on in the alpha right now, because MMR has been reset, and, like, yeah, people just do not seem to know what they're doing in most of my games. Like, why is this cuckoo here? Go there. Oh my god, I one-shot those things. Okay. Yeah, I may as well do a bit of jungling in between waves if cuckoo's going to try and take my waves, right? We don't have a low key, so... Oh, dude, he's waiting in the bushes? Okay, I mean, that's fine, I guess. Swoops back. I've got enough for uh, Dagger Frenzy. Yeah, I'm gonna go into uh, just Baylor's Eye next, get some uh, magical percent pen online. I feel like that's pretty important. As much as I'm building strength and using autos, I still do magical damage, so we still need that magical pen. Dude, I got so much attack speed already, and that's not even with my Dagger Frenzy active, which I need to remember I have, because I always forget. I want to go in on this cuckoo, man, but because we have a DC jungler, it feels like Loki's just kind of, like, free lurking. Oh, hello. Get the stun on him. Oh my god, dude, I'm shredding. <laughs> Jesus. It's a shame we have a DC, man. This, this could have been a really good game for me. Oh, oh, okay. Not even close. Okay, it's basically turned into arena right now, dude. There's just three people in there. Maybe rotate over to right, try and help out, uh, our son on us. Oh, he's living. Maybe get the Neath. All the Bologna. Get the stun. Nice, dude. Okay, I kind of use all my cooldowns there, though. Probably won't be able to get the Neath. Dude, I'm on a rampage right now. Can we win this 4v5? Probably not, right? But I'm doing, like, so much damage right now. Oh, I forgot to use my thing in that fight as well. I don't think it would have really made a difference. I don't think I was going to get the Neath anyway, but I forgot to use my active item. Dude, look at this attack speed. <laughs> I wonder if there's any more, like, intelligence-based attack speed items I could get. I think there is one with, like, crit. Yeah, death metal, strength, intelligence, and crit. Oh, this is... Oh, no, yeah, I want this, dude. I definitely want Hand of the Abyss. Yeah, that's going to be my next item after I get my pen. Gives bonus basic attack damage, uh, intelligence, attack speed. Oh my god. Dude, I'm shredding him. Oh my god, that is not fair. Okay, Bologna's here. I maybe need a little bit of CDR, dude. I feel like my cooldowns are very long. Oh, I've got a charge. Nah, oh, nice, dude. Cuckoo gets it. Dude, can we win this 4v5? That would be pretty sick, dude. Unfortunately, I don't think Loki's ever coming back. But we could try to win the 4v5. Doing so much damage right now. Oh, so else is here, dude. We can shove this in. Oh, this procs on towers as well? Okay, lethal. Kind of fine with that. Okay, we got a couple of the tower bounties, though. Let's grab that one as well. Oh my god, look at my gold, man. I'm so fed. The chalk is almost equally as, as fed, though. Okay, I should probably back out here. I'm a bit low. I don't want to give him any uh, big, big fast shutdowns or anything. Oh, is he fine? Yeah, he's fine. All right, we got our full evil eye online. Get some of that percent pen because uh, Chuck is quite a problem right now. Even though he is going like a mostly damage based build by the looks of it. Got Meteor Hammer. He's got Jones. Uh, he's got some physical prop there, but we don't really care about that. Still nice to have the pen. Even 30% pen or 25, whatever this is, it's still going to be useful against Squishies. It's no flat pen, unfortunately. Ah, uh, flat pen is gone, but. Oh, dude, they're going in. Nice, dude. 
Just an absolute party in mid lane right now. Oh, what's going on over here? Is that Loki? It is. Oh, I wanna I wanna get blink, dude. Like I wanna blink in on like two people. Dude, we could probably kill here, right? Oh give me that movement speed. No, dude. I'm not gonna be able to get that. We can turn around underneath though. Dude, look how much my autos are chunking her. Oh my god. <laughs> AA Zeus fucking OP, dude. Holy shit. Okay, Chak's rotating. We can maybe try and get on him, though. He isn't actually that tanky. Speed's that, uh, silence. Yeah, dude, nah, I'm absolutely deleting people. This is not fair. <laughs> can we carry this 4v5, man? Okay, that's, uh, Loki speeds as well. Dude, this build is nutty. People are right, dude. Auto attack Zeus is insane right now. Maybe I have to try tank Zeus as well. Agro said tank Zeus is OP, apparently. Let's see if we can just get in and do the thing on these. Gas is all down as well. Okay, Balon is here. I think I'm just gonna back. We'll start into um, Hand of the Abyss. Which gives me intelligence, attack speed, and bonus basic attack damage, whatever hit gods or jungle bosses. Very much all things I want in this build. And then that'll probably be it for my attack speed. I might go into like, I don't know, maybe some crit? We could go like Deathbringer, dude. Just go for the hella funny build. Or maybe we could go like Blink or, or some kind of defense. Usually like one defense item or something is kind of good if you're trying to like solo carry like I'm doing right now. In the 4v5, I'm going to need to live in these fights. If I die, like it's kind of ogre for us. Also, auto attackers in general are kind of nice if you have a little bit of tank on them because you can just live longer and get more auto attacks out. Oh, nice root. Chuck that balloon a little bit. Maybe some life steal could be good too. The thing is, there's not a lot of good intelligence life steal items. I could go with strength life steal item, I suppose. But then my abilities are really going to not hit very hard if I start going a lot of strength. I think the only intelligence lifesteal item in the game is Bloodbound Book, which gives you a health shield when you're low. Which isn't terrible, I guess. Doesn't feel great, though. Can we take a tower here, maybe? No one's here at the moment. I do have some chunky autos. Yeah, now we definitely take that. Get the bounties. Yeah, I was like, that's 250 gold, plus I think another 150 for taking the tower. That just gave me so much money. Let's see if we can gank the Chark. Okay, they get gold, unfortunately. They just have more people. Get the slow. Get the stun. Oh my god, dude. That's a tank I'm deleting. Okay, he's gone. I completely whiffed my ult. I thought there was actually a way through there, but it was actually just a, a dead end. We got him though, we got him. Kind of want this dude, red buff's like actually really good. Oh dude, he's ulting it? Okay. Okay, we got it, nice. Yeah, I got that attacks and abilities apply uh, max health poison. Hello. Stone. And he's dead. Okay, I gotta get out though. For some reason this skin uh, doesn't have a voice pack. Uh, the voice lines just don't do anything, but... Might be getting a little bit too ridiculous on the attack speed there, but you know what? Yeah, let's do it. Let's go out to Lana's, man. We'll stack the basic attack movement penalty with my two and hopefully get, like, Omega Haste. See what we can do here. We're actually not far behind at all, considering we have a DC Loki that has, like, no farm. Like, I think per person, we're definitely ahead. I mean, look at me, dude. I have a almost 12k goal compared to, like, 8k for pretty much everyone else. or 10k on their team. Oh, dude, someone else is in. Let me clear these out real quick. Dude, Sonos is kind of farming right now. Let's grab this. Dude, 2.01 attack speed already. That's without my auto. Uh -oh. Okay, this is all down. Oh my god, Shaq's here too. Okay, nah, I'm dead. They've shut me down here. They've shut me down. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate, dude. It's three people mid. Yeah, dude, that's a really unfortunate shutdown. They probably got a lot of gold off of that. 
That was hell of fun. That was nine and one at that point. I think I was on a nine killing spree because I died once early game to the Loki. Okay, let's get a speed buff. I feel like that's gonna be good for me. Once I get Atalanta's as well, I'm gonna have like so much haste. I'm gonna have haste out the wazoo. Oh, dude, there's a lot of people there. Can we go in? Oh, Bologna's in. Yeah, okay, let's try and gank her. Drop the ult. Oh my god, dude, I'm shredding. Can I get a third charge? That is a stun. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> this build is absolutely nutty. Like, this is actually good. Like, this is not troll like ADC Zeus in Smite 1. This is like genuinely fucking shredding. Oh my god, I'm deleting people. I want to do gold, but I don't think I could solo it, is the problem. I don't have any lifesteal. Can we maybe try and get on this chat, though. And call gank me, but unfortunately, my voice pack's silent. Oh, he's there? Yeah, let's get him. One, two, three, stun, and he's gone. Loki as well? Oh, dude, missed the chain lightning. I'm so fast, though, dude. I have this movement speed buff. Nice stun. Oh my god, dude, he's gone. <laughs> he's gone. I want to call gold, but I don't know if this... Uh, one, my voice back is silent, so it's kind of annoying to do so. And two, I don't I don't know if this team even know what Gold Fury is, man, to be completely honest. <laughs> this uh, is a little bit wacky, man. The alpha matchmaking, obviously, there's no MMR. Oh, there is, but it's, like, been reset, so... Some of the games are kind of wacky. But, like, we're kind of winning this 4v5 right now, man. At least in terms of kills. We're not ahead in farm, because, we, like, we have a low kid with 6k, but... Well, I think we're doing all right, dude. I think yeah. we're doing all right. Hi, Bologna. I mean, I'd probably win this 1v1. It's just if there's someone else lurking, I don't I don't want to get shut down again. I'll probably just back, dude. I have 2.6k in hand. Let's just get some items. Honestly, some physical D could be handy. Cuckoo's not really doing all that much to me, and then the rest of their team is physical. So maybe just a little bit of physical D. Is there any physical D attack speed items? No, there isn't. That's unfortunate. Maybe we just go Helm of Radiance, dude. Gives me some in, gives me some physical prop. I think that's probably the play. I feel like just a little bit of defense here is going to be super handy because uh, Cuckoo, he's not really hitting abilities all that much and kind of juke most of his stuff. And uh, the rest of their team's physical, so I feel like having a little bit of defense could uh, help me live in these fights and try and carry this one. Yeah, the farm is super wacky. Like, partly it's probably because of uh, matchmaking, but you can get such a massive gold lead in this game. It's insane. Look at my gold compared to everyone else. Chuck's the only one anywhere close. Ow. Oh, yeah, dude. We could defo gank, right? I kind of want to get this as well before we fight. I was going to do this in jungle, but I decided to go mid. I feel like this, this build could also definitely work in jungle. Where did they all go from right lane? I guess they all just backed. I could try and do gold. Thing is, that, oh, they probably TP'd, yeah. Can I do gold? Do I have enough damage? Nah, definitely not. Objectives seem to do a lot of damage to you in Smite 2. Okay, they're, they're definitely going to lose the fight over there. I don't think I can get over there in time. Let's just get this farm. How much do we need for 2,000? Maybe I could just quickly farm up my full Helm of Radiance. Get that online for the next fight. Yeah, dude, we're getting kind of wrecked in a lot of these fights. I'm kind of the only one doing anything. Cuckoo's kind of doing stuff, so Nuss is doing a good bit of damage, but uh, we have no tank and it's uh, 4v5. It's kind of, kind of difficult. We don't even have like any of our jungle camps leveled up either because no one's really doing them. DC jungle. Uh, I can't really stop them doing that either, I don't think. Let's just back. Actually, nah, I don't want to back. I want to get enough for full Helm of Radiance. I still can't stop them doing the tower, but I can probably hold Phoenix. Oh, definitely can hold Phoenix, though. It's actually kind of low. Just force the Bologna out a little bit. Uh, okay, that's pretty much enough for my thing. Let's back and uh, get that. Oh, big fight going on in mid. Let's see if we can get in there. Try and gank him. Okay, that's nice, uh, nice jump. 
Get the stone. Oh, dude, it's book. Dude, I'm chunking that shark right now. Okay, sadly, I don't think we can really get anything done on him. Oh, dude, no, I'm so dead. Oh, I'm not dead, though. Oh, my God, that helm that I bought with the physical D, that absolutely saved my life. I feel like I'd die there 100% if I didn't have the helm. Oh, hi, Cuckoo. My helm doesn't do a whole lot against Cuckoo. Can we get this Bologna? Cuckoo probably has it, but... Nice, dude. Another rampage. I was probably just get out of here. Okay, hello, Cuckoo. Oh, dude, needs here as well. Okay, Cuckoo altered the buff. <laughs> I don't think a single objective has been done, man. Can we can we try and do gold? I'm gonna try and let Anubis tank this. He probably has lifesteal, maybe even some tank items, good support. <clears throat> oh dude, I'm so dead. I don't know why I tried to pull gold there, man. We just didn't have the damage. At least he got gold. Probably killed the Chak as well. Okay, one for one and we get gold. That's actually worth. Yeah, dude, we're still winning this in terms of, like, kills and stuff, but just being a man down so hard. Also, like, my big farm lead is going to start not mattering real soon. Uh, all I've got left to buy is uh, the elixirs, which, uh, I mean, to be fair, they're pretty good because I'll also use the elixir of strength. Like, both the elixirs are going to be good for me here because uh, the strength is nice for my autos, and obviously uh, Zeus' intelligence is pre pretty good, turns out. Has some very good intelligence scaling on his abilities. So we do have those two elixirs to go, I guess, but at some point my gold lead is going to really stop mattering and we're just in a 4v5 late game at that point. I believe though, boys. I believe. We just need one good fight win. And actually to start doing some objectives. Oh, is there someone here? Yeah, I hear Loki on... Is he on Loki's on red buff, I think. Yeah. Okay, he's out of there. Is he going to come in on me? Nah, dude, he's a pussy. <laughs> dude, <laughs> fucking enemy minions in my jungle. That's like a really weird bug in the alpha. The minions just run in a jungle for some reason. Get stunned? Dude, this is a tank I'm absolutely melting. Okay, Loki's here too, though. And Cuckoo, yeah, the whole team's here. We need to try and group up. Oh, nice, dude. Anubis is going ham. Oh, okay, we just don't know for that. Oh my god, dude, I'm shredding. Beats that. Get my two. Get the stun. No, dude, the block stacks. Oh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, this is just too difficult, man. Honestly, I I, I kind of do want to vote that surrender, but I'm going to vote a seven just because uh, I'm recording for this. So it'd be funny if we could win a 4v5, but this is rough, dude. Oh, I've lucky to DC. This is so free. That's such a nice early game. I don't know if it's like alpha servers being wacky or whatever, or if it's just people leaving because they know there's going to be no punishment in the alpha, really. But uh, there's been a lot of DCs uh, in my games lately. Oh. Okay, dude, my, my game just crashed entirely. Uh, maybe we can get back in. <laughs> okay, yeah, g game just crashed entirely there. Uh, I don't know what happened. I've got this uh, for 27 minutes now, unfortunately. So I assume they either surrendered or the game got ended like immediately after I DC'd. Uh, that was unfortunate, but that was still a pretty sick game, I feel like. Uh, Auto Attack Zeus went hard there. If we didn't have a DC, I feel like that was absolutely free. I'll probably still post that one. That was a fun game. Uh, unfortunately, it's an alpha. You're going to get a lot of like DCs from people crashing and stuff. Like, Loki might have crashed the same way I did and just couldn't get back in. Like, it's an alpha. You kind of got to expect that. But yeah, hopefully you guys still enjoyed this one and I will catch you guys in another one tomorrow on Intergames. Peace.